Oh, the sun is glaring on my face. Good morning, everybody. I am at the Airport um, Office Park supporting Gofana. She's got a workshop going. I don't know if you guys know. Club. She is host, um, what do you call it? Personal branding workshop. Hello. So consistency and clear brand message is at the heart of every personal brand. So examples of successful everyday personal brands. And the first one, since she's here, I'm gonna ask her, is yours. So you can read about yourself. We had one sit down and discuss the social media strategy and approach. We identified what worked for her and she got to work and was very consistent. Your was being the operative word. <laughs> <Stop>. <laughs> Results in six months she grew to ten K Instagram followers and ten thousand YouTube when you put it like oh, this, God. it actually sounds so weird. Oh. But it did happen it exactly did. like that. It yeah. did. And in a, in a little less than a year, she resigned from We That's True and started working full-time as a YouTuber and influencer. That's wow, phenomenal. I actually want to cry. Yeah. Because <laughs> this is actually inspiring. Now I feel like I've slacked. But anyway. <laughs> but you haven't. You've wow. achieved everything you wanted to yeah. achieve. Mm. Yeah. And now you can tell us the reason why you came to the workshop. So everybody said their reason why. So you oh, can tell your okay. reason why. Well, now it's to refine things. It's to get back to my why, really, as I walked in and that's exactly what Kapana was talking about. Just to get back to the why and to focus again, because once you set a goal, and I think that's the thing about short to medium goals, there needs to be a longer term goal, one that propels you even when you've reached the short term one. Mm -hmm. So now we've reached 10,000 subscribers, we've we reached 10,000 Instagram followers, and I'm sit sitting at 14 and 15 either side. And that took longer to actually get to after the 10k mark. Mm -hmm. So I'm here to get back to the anchor and then propel myself every single time you reach a target. Mm -hmm. What happens then, y'all? What do you look forward to and what keeps you going mm -hmm. um, once you've reached those targets? So that's why I'm here today. Congrats on reaching your goal. Thank you. Good morning. It's Sunday. Well, <laughs> good afternoon, actually. It's Sunday afternoon, and I'm off to the ethnic hair and beauty show. I hate vlogging and driving, so I'm gonna continue driving and actually end this hello, hello, hello situation. Waiting for someone, this lady who's gonna get me because I'm here as an appearance actually. So I don't have a ticket, I don't want people at the gate. So I don't want to be explaining things at the gate like, oh, actually, I'm a blogger, blah blah blah. Wow, they're about to stop the music, it's gonna be louder. Oh, here you are! <laughs> How are you? Good, thanks. Me Michelle or Mitch? What's your full name? Mitch. Oh, oh, really? That's interesting, Yolanda. Nice to meet you too. I am on my way home now. I'm about to leave and to avoid um, vlogging while driving, which should not be done. I am vlogging just before I drive off. I've been here for about an hour and a half and it was really, really cool. I actually really enjoy hair events that are not the same. So in this case, there was a hair show going on. There was a whole lot of obviously different brands selling their products, doing this, doing that. 
um but at the same time i loved the fact that there was so much entertainment like there were people sitting around the stage doing their thing really enjoyed the event something different it was really really packed and i also got to catch up with people that i know thank you for those of you who are here and came to say hi to me i always enjoy meeting you guys so thank you for all of you who did come and say hi hey 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 it's getting hot in the car and yeah i don't want my face to melt in front of everyone right now so let's go home just got home walking up the stairs I recently just found a recipe on Foodies of SA page on Instagram and we just saw like a what's it called love something but something but anyway let me just check it out to show you guys so I'm gonna try and make exactly what you're seeing on your screen mm. Mm. and since you guys loved the food well, the food part of the vlog that I did last week, I thought I should add another edition of us cooking, this time with my hubby. So he's gonna make the meat and I'm gonna make the bubbles. It looks amazing. a spoon what do you want can you tell that i'm in a daze i just had the best massage ever a full body and she put that pressure on my back oh wow i feel so good i'm gonna take a dip and yeah i'm feeling so relaxed i'm feeling, cool. I'm feeling like i'm floating right now anyway let me go take a sip how was your massage it was good I hope you're having a super chilled Sunday. We were just chilling outside in the balcony today as a fam bam. <laughs> and I realized oh, I've got to edit. So before I edit, I wanted to show you guys what I got from Easy Waves the other day. A box packed with products. And as you know, I am not relaxed and these products are recommended for relaxed hair. So I thought, you know what? Let me do a giveaway for three of you before I give the competition rules and everything else. Let's get into this box and see what's inside. And then we can decide how we split these products amongst three of you. Over here, I have two conditioner hairsprays. I suppose these are really good for like braids, um, but it says here 
Comat conditioner hairspray moisturizes and reduces dryness, leaving your hair soft, shiny, and easy to manage. So I've got two of these. Then I do have this co activated gel with glycerine. I used to use this when I was relaxed as well. Next up, we've got the anti frizz oil sheen spray over here. So over here, I've got the shampoo and then I've got the moisturizer next to it. Then I have the moisture gel and moisture spray then i also have the pink oil moisturizing spray i know i used to use this back in the day as well when i was relaxed can y'all see that and then i see they sent me a boost out curl relaxer i suppose this is a softer version of like a straightening relaxer because it says curl relaxer and yeah if anyone wants this one in particular please let me know down in the comment section so if you want this i'll actually make this the fourth giveaway this and i'll mix it with one of the hair foods next are these different hair foods that i received i've got four of these with me and they all seem to be different there's amla oil and coconut oil on the side and then over here i have the rooibos rooibos extract and linolin as well so yeah these are the four um hair foods that i have okay so the competition rules are pretty simple you have to be subscribed to y'all's channel you have to follow y'all's channel on instagram and of course you can be based anywhere in south africa i'm opening this up outside of Joburg as well and of course you've got to be relaxed so all you have to do is let me know down in the comment section if you are a relaxed hair girl and you may win yourself uh, three of these products or two in the case of you winning a relaxer and the hair food and of course please leave me your instagram handle so that i can find out if you're following me firstly and i can dm you if you are a winner so that me and you can chat about how i can deliver your package to you in the quickest and most convenient time so yeah that's about it in terms of easy waves i've heard really good things about these products in fact i did visit their stand at the ethnic hair show last week where i met a couple of you guys in fact i met some savvies there they had a makeup artist there doing people's makeup and they had a stylist who was styling people like doing funky haircuts they were literally going whichever direction you wanted in terms of the hairstyle that you wanted so that was pretty cool i think this is where i'm going to end the video i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog this week oh by the way my husband challenged me so from the 1st of november right up until the 7th of november i'm going to be doing seven days of vlogging i'm gonna pretend i'm a daily vlogger except not all seven days will be like vlogs vlog style some will be like videos informative videos um and some interesting bits that i've sort of planned out so it's gonna be interesting i'm gonna call it the daily dose of y'alls stay tuned for that i'm super excited but scared at the same time because i'm just like am i gonna make it like how am i gonna do it i'm gonna like film a video today edit it today and then upload it tonight oh my gosh i don't know i don't know i don't know but i'm really excited and i also want to feature him we might do a relationship q a stay tuned if you follow me on the socials if you don't please do follow me on the socials because that's where i have most q a's anyway so yeah I, I feel like since he challenged me you know he should join me in the q a like you know, you know what i mean um make it easy for me so yeah that's what to expect this coming week i love you guys so so much don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already bye